All right, it's that time once again for another Ashran Trash Can, February the 16th, 2024. Looks like we've got 20 Maniacs up in the house. We're going to head to the crossroads here for the initial team fight. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, and notification bell. Where are they going to go? Oh, we got a few there trying to hit us at mid. Okay. Get a little team fight action here. They're all clumped up right there. We're on top of this flag. Grasshopper's going to come in first. Obviously, this looks like a partial RR. Don't see all their people that they normally have, but it's definitely got some of them in here. Grasshopper has got Life Cocoon in the back. And they're going to go down. Yeah. Doesn't matter how many times you roll. Lights out. We got to tap on this first flag. Easy mode. Grasshopper's back up. Must have had Res or Soul Stone. Either way. Bop's not going to save you. Get him down. There we go. Second kill. We'll take two kills on the same target. Got to grip some more heals, though. They have a lot of them. They got, what, five priests? <laughs> Quite a few healers. We got enough heals, too, though, so it's actually even playing field for once. It's not one of those matches where Blizzard screws up the matchmaking and one side gets a ton of healers and the other side gets none or hardly any. We're starting to get some more kills, though. We lost one person in this team fight so far. 50 DKP minus to the death, right? <laughs> Disoriented. It's gone. Now we can push into him. Priest healer is down over there on the left. Gripping in the shaman. Take out their shammy healer. Slippy fists. Yeah, someone needs the grips. We only have, what, one DK in here, though, to grip, so... Grips might be on cooldown. Just sniper shot whatever we can. I'm on the hunter because I shot the sheriff. Finish off the warlock here. We're pushing into the next flag. That mage hit combust. Get him down. We don't like to see mages bussing. Got to get them out of here into that graveyard. Warlock's going to go down. We're eating through all their cooldowns. They had nothing left. They already popped the dark pack and everything. Capping the next flag. We've got a hunter in the back here still to mess with. Got him. And a demon hunter wants to come up here too. We're going to go and take out their mage. After F4 caps, we're going to go to the right. Cross right across over here. Heading up this way. They got maybe some team that might be going to try to check out our back door. We don't have hardly anybody in our base. We got one person it looks like. Let's just go across this bridge. Don't chase them. Take out these healers here. Get them down. We're only four minutes into the match already. If we get this flag capped, it's going to be stuck here for ten minutes. And with the amount of pressure we've been applying, more than likely we'll be able to take out their mage, push all across the bridge, and take out the Grand Marshal too. All in one fell swoop. Bye bye Hunter. They're falling back to their gladiators. Your glads won't save you in a little bit here because they're going to be despawned. They do have a Boomy that's doing a pretty good damage. Right up there with Dirty Bird and Brambling right now. Question is, will they be able to knock us out of their base once we get everything going here? Take out their mage. They got a couple up here. Just a rogue left now, it looks like. Rogue's got nothing left except for Vanish. Better Vanish soon. Mr. Assassination Rogue, there he goes. But I can still see you because I had Hunter's Mark on you and you had no Cloak of Shadows. He glided out though. Now we can easily take out the Mage. Nice 30 points there. It gives us a hefty lead. Now we got to take out some more Hunters in our face. They got a lot of Hunters. <laughs> Granted, I mean, we have a few Hunters too, I guess. We have six. They got more than six for sure. Take out their one Rogue that's overextending. Now that you got nothing left, there's no way you're going to escape now, right? There we go. All their healers are kind of stacked up right here. One goes down. Taking down heals your ass. Is that what the guy's name was? <laughs> We're pushing across the bridge now. We don't need Cronus. Who needs Cronus? Cronus is just a crutch, man. The only people that need Cronus are people that don't have enough damage. And we got plenty in this match here. You look over there on the damage meter. We got, what, eight of the top ten slots, so we got plenty of damage right now, so we can push in without Cronus. Only really use Cronus for a distraction, because a lot of times the other enemy team, they'll all focus him, 
And then you can just go ahead and take out the boss in peace. I'm stuck in this ring here right now, so I'm just going to do some DPS from far. The ring will disappear here soon. Now I can move. Let's get the Grand Marshal pulled. Yeah, we could just take out the boss right here. End it right now, man. We're only seven minutes into the match. Straight pushing the flags all the way here. Take him out. Dirty Bird takes top damage. I'm trying to mess with Grasshopper in the back. You got to make sure those monks stay away from the boss because they like to use that overflowing mist. That's why we got to sit there and focus Grasshopper. If the boss starts going up in HP, that's what we know what to do. <laughs> Doesn't look like the boss is going up, though. We're good to go. Execute range. Yeah, the boss got melted there. 4-0, man. Not bad. I will take it. Looks like Necro, Lord, and Elof for the top hills. May all of your random battlegrounds be epic. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Until next time, GG for the Horde.